G'day, it's Phil here, and welcome back to my channel. Today we have the final tally of the Tassie Coin Hunter Silver Stacking Challenge. It is uh, December the 27th, and I've finally got all the silver that I'm going to get for this year. So let's go through what I've got for December. For December, I've got two pieces of silver. One of them I bought myself, and the other one was a present from my wife. So, I was very, very pleased to get a Christmas present of silver. Uh, this is the one that I bought myself. It's a uh, kangaroo from the Royal, Royal uh, Perth Mint. Sorry, the Perth Mint. So, it's a $1.999 fine silver kangaroo 2020 one ounce dated. And so, I was very happy to pick that up. I thought that I needed to uh, fill up my last little bit of silver. And this is the coin that my wife bought for me from Bullion Now, uh, which is a 2023 Britannia, which she thought it was quite a, a nice coin for me to have. Wasn't sure if I had it or not because she didn't check with me before getting it, but it's a very, very nice coin and looks like it might be relatively uh, rare in the wild, but I'm very, very happy to have it and also very, very happy to just be supported by my wife in my silver stacking. So that's what I've got for the month of December. Two pieces of silver, two ounces, which makes my tally, oh, let me put this over here, makes my tally uh, this. So as you can see, I have hit the one kilogram mark. I've actually bl not blown it out of the water, but I've gone a little bit over. And the reason that I've gone a little bit over is if you go back and have a look at the tallies for uh, October and November, you'll see that I added the silver in but I didn't actually add it onto the total. So silly old Phil, he had the same total of, uh, of silver for both October and November, and I thought I had to get more to get the December number, but I already made it in November. So I was really happy when I found that out, but it means I've got extra, extra silver uh, on the challenge, which for me just means that I can be happy that I've covered all the little bits of um, not 100% silver that I got because I did get a few sterling silver coins uh, and a couple of 80% silver coins in the 66 round 50s. So with that extra little bit of silver, 100% silver, I've made 100% uh, silver one kilo challenge. So Tassie Coin Hunter, thank you very much for inviting everyone to join in the challenge. Uh, and it is a challenge, honestly, uh, to get a kilo of silver in uh, numismatic coins, not bars or anything like that. It is actually quite a bit of a challenge. Uh, if you go back and look at my videos, you'll see that I started out relatively slowly at sort of you know, 50 to 60 grams a month. And then I had to really step it up after the, uh, the my half year hiatus where I had a big fat zero in uh, in June and then uh, came back with uh, multiple purchases through the second half of the year. And you really have to, uh, if you want to uh, buy coins or you want to get coins that make a, a silver one kilo, you've got to get a lot. And I'm going to show you that now. I'm going to take these coins and take the total off the, off the screen. And then I'm going to show you what my kilo consists of uh, in packaged and then unpackaged. And then I'll be back uh, to say goodbye. All packaged up. Uh, had a bit of a tough time actually trying to fit it into the screen. Uh, there's so many rounds and boxes. And now I'm just going to take all the other coins out of the boxes so that we can get it all on the one screen. And that's what it is, all out of its packaging. You can see it all there. A mix of $10, $1, circulated coins, overseas coins, but all silver. And that is my Tassie Coin Hunter 1 kilogram Silver Challenge. Again, thank you, Tazzy, for prompting me to come into the challenge and, and get my own silver. Uh, I've got my silver for this year. Unfortunately, I have to tell you, I'm probably not going to be in it next year if you do do it. But I'll support anyone who uh, has a crack because it is fun and it gets you silver and gets you coins. So thank you, everyone. It's going to be a short one because all I'm going to show you is my silver stack. I'll put a photo of this as well up on my community channel and I might chuck a photo over to Tazzy Coin Hunter and so his Facebook uh, group can see that as well. But again, thank you very much guys. I'll be back for more coins and, and noodling anyway in a couple of days. So I'll see you then. Bye.